Hey, what's happening? It's Nick with Lone Star Boot Reviews, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Try Easy Boot Jack by Jeremiah Craig and Twisted Willow Fabrication. So Jeremiah Craig is a great YouTube reviewer of cowboy boots. If you're not familiar with him, I'll put his channel down in the description. And he sat down a while ago and wanted to come up with a boot jack that was different from what he had seen. He wanted one that actually folded in half to make it a small profile. If you wanted to take it, you know, on a trip in your suitcase or what have you, or just store it away at your house. But he also wanted it to be really tough and nearly indestructible. So he called up his father who runs a small machine shop and they went over some ideas. His father came up with a design, sent him a prototype, and the thing was just awesome. He did a full video review on it. I'll put that link in the description as well. He was running over this thing with a car. He was throwing it 30 feet up in the air. I mean, it just held up to whatever abuse he threw at it. So with that being said, let's take a look at it. So Jeremiah contacted me after I had done a review on some boot jacks in the past and asked me if I wanted to review his and I said absolutely. I was really excited to get this and he actually did some custom engraving on it for me. So it's got Jeremiah's logo right here. He's also a really great musician so check out his music on his channel as well. He put Lone Star on the side here for me and then on the other side he put Take It Easy which I say at the end of all my videos. So that was a really cool custom touch. Right here it says Try Easy Boot Jack. Now this thing is made out of aluminum and it's got kind of a sandblasted or brushed finish on it. It looks really nice. Okay, so the way this works is the front portion folds out like this and then there's a little leg that folds out this way. And all this is held on by these Allen screws here, and it all rotates around those. Now to me, the tension out of the package was perfect, but if it's a little too tight or a little too loose, you can adjust it by putting a wrench on a nut here and then turning the Allen screw with an Allen wrench. And honestly, I'd try like quarter turn at a time just to see. I don't think it's gonna take a whole lot to tighten it or loosen it. Well, on the underneath side, it's got Twisted Willow Fabrications logo as well as a QR code that will take you to Jeremiah Craig's website. He has a lot of merch for sale on there. He has his CDs for sale. It's got, you know, his bio and everything. So check that out. So everywhere that it comes in contact with your boot or the ground, it's got a polyurethane plastic. That's going to keep, you know, your wood floors from getting marred up or scratching up the back of your boot. You always want to have some kind of padding or a different kind of material than wood or metal anywhere that's going to touch your boot for sure. But on the ground, it's a nice touch as well. But overall, the quality of the construction of this thing is just, it's awesome. I mean, it's second to none as far as any boot jacks I've seen. Folds up really easy. And it's a nice, small, compact size. This can go in your, your book bag, your backpack, your suitcase. You can stick it in the side pocket of your door, your car. I mean, it, it can go anywhere. And it doesn't weigh very much at all. I thought it was going to be heavier, and it's not. If I had to guess, I'd say, I don't know, maybe pound, pound and a half. It's really not that heavy at all. So yeah, so far I'm pretty impressed, but what do you say we try it out and see how it really performs? First, I have these Ariats that are a little bit snug and we'll see how it goes. Effortless. I mean, that worked like a charm. Okay, so lastly, I'm gonna try it with my Hondos. These are probably my most snug pair of boots that I own. They feel good, but they're just a little bit tighter than the rest. I mean, came off like butter. I don't know what else you'd want. Totally effortless. Even the one that was pretty tight, the Hondo, it works great. I think this is an awesome product. Let's go back up top and I'll give you my final thoughts. Okay, so final thoughts. I love this thing. You know, I mentioned in my last boot jack video that I've never really owned a boot jack because I didn't have that 
hard a time bending over to pull my boots off. But I've got a few pair now that are just a little bit snug and it's a little bit of a struggle. So I will definitely be using this. Also, it's great to have outside. If you come home with muddy or dirty boots, you can just pull them off before you go in the house. This thing is built like a tank. You know, I mentioned earlier Jeremiah's video, he tried to destroy it and you just can't do it. So this will last you a lifetime. You know, the only maintenance you're really gonna have to do is tightening or loosening these Allen screws. Now, he told me this is the 2020 model. This is the original model. And he's got a few of these left in stock. They're just under $100. But if you want one before the end of the year, he will throw in free engraving for you. Now, when the new model comes out in 2021, that engraving is going to be like a $30 or $40 charge. And also, he's doing a few tweaks to the design, and the price is going to go up on the boot jack slightly. I'm not exactly sure how much, but it's going to be a little more expensive than the current one. But yeah, if you, if you like this and you want to get one, take advantage of that. Snag one of the last few he has and go ahead and get you some free engraving thrown on there. But yeah, I mean, I love this thing. I plan on keeping this forever. I don't foresee me ever having to buy a different boot jack. It's really nice. It works really well. I love the fact that it folds up and I can just shove it on a bookshelf or in a drawer. You know, I don't have to have it laying out all the time. And if I go on a trip, I can throw it in my suitcase or my backpack. This definitely gets the Lone Star stamp of approval. There's a lot of thought that went into the design of this, and I think they knocked it out of the park with it. It's so simple, but works so well. So that's all I have for today, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and make sure you click that little bell so you're notified every time I upload a video. Thank you to all my subscribers. Thank you to everybody who's watching. Please check out my Patreon link down below, and I'll see you all on the next one. Take it easy.